follow the call, the ancient tracks. Uncover the link between earth and life. Feel the energy, see the impact. The endless flow, it's so precious. A true gem. It is Southern Africa. Heartland of Gondwana, cradle of humankind. A piece of earth where a massive uplift over 100 million years has resulted in an elevated topography, exposing amazing geological features and mineral deposits. It is here where the history of the earth and the evolution of life are best preserved. It is the point from which a possible sixth extinction event can best be understood. The perfect forum for scientific debate. Southern Africa presents a fascinating fusion of old and new, a place in time where an international geology conference can be held in an ultra-modern venue, just a stone's throw from where a footprint left on a beach dune presents the first evidence of modern humans on our globe. From the time of arrival in metropolitan Cape Town, delegates will enjoy modern convenience along with spectacular sights. The very reason the Cape is one of the world's most popular tourist destinations. The Cape Town International Convention Center, where the conference is to be held, is perfectly placed for easy access from the city's international airport and surrounded by choice accommodation and restaurants. There are more than 3,500 rooms within walking distance of the center, ranging from luxury to budget accommodation. A 45-minute radius presents more than 16,000 rooms in hotels, auberges and guest houses. The Cape Town International Convention Center is ideally suited to the requirements of IGC. In fact, it has been the venue of choice for numerous international events, including the World Diabetes Conference attended by 12,300 delegates. Surrounding all this modern convenience lies a myriad of geological treasures covering 3.6 billion years of Earth's history. After all my extensive travels around the world, I've realized that South Africa is the paradise for geologists, in fact, natural scientists. And uh, it, it's telling, most of my colleagues around the world want to come here. And that's because we have probably the longest extended and richest geological history preserved in Southern Africa. It tells the story from the cradle of life three and a half billion years ago to the cradle of humankind uh, in, uh, in the southern part of, uh, of the country and particularly along the southern coast where we find evidence that uh, humans have sculptured the first human artifacts. The mountain right here behind me, that's a focal point of a scientific theory that uh, tells us about how continents drifted apart 250 million years ago, these mountains were connected to Argentina, to South America, Antarctica, India, and the entire way of drifting a part of these continents tells part of this story of how the Earth works and how it's evolved. And I know that many of my colleagues uh, overseas know in their hearts that they haven't seen the entire story until they've come to South Africa. And they all want to do that, certainly, before they die. In addition to the geological features unfolding the Earth's history, many a world industry revolves around the precious metals mined in Southern Africa. 2016 will also mark the 150th anniversary of the discovery of diamonds in South Africa. In terms of energy, the region boasts breakthrough technology in coal utilization and has the second largest uranium resources in the world. It is with great pride that I welcome you to South Africa, a beautiful country, a cradle of humankind, a country united in its diversity. We wish that this experience will enrich you. Lisa, Lisa.
Southern Africa beats to a rare and magical rhythm. Here, in the tracks of its origin, man can enjoy the fruits of evolution, explore the secrets of the ocean. Here, game run free where their ancestors once grazed. Here, you live a million years in one day. Here in the south of Africa, you can dance with Earth.